What is going on everybody? Welcome back to the AGHB channel. I wanted to start off today's ride with a view of the bike. Uh, we got the suspension from TBT done and then we also got the skid plate from AXP put on there. There's a double layer protection for the linkage now so I should be good and the best part about it is it's it's made of like a plastic polyurethane I think it was called can't remember um, but it's like super slim and super minimal so it's not like this big heavy thing that's on there which I'm really really excited to test out because it shouldn't add any weight not that I would have noticed to be honest and also now that the suspension is done I can actually almost touch both feet on the ground which is the best part and I'm really excited to test out suspension but today uh, Dana and I have decided to do sort of like a old school type video but once we get riding we'll tell you guys more about it because it's a little hot so I told Dana that today I wanted to take it a little easy and uh, kind of go back to the roots of the old channel when we first started out riding together I wanted to take it old school and do some of the old exploring that we used to do back on the dual sports when Dana had his WR and I had my WR250 Supermoto and he was sort of like teaching me how to ride those were some really, really, really fun days and I feel like lately we've been doing a lot of technical riding and uh, we just haven't had like, a good adventure. You know, it's crazy to think that it's already been a year since uh, my birthday in Vegas and it just, I don't know, now that I'm out here and we're trying to, you know, make more videos closer to what we were doing, it just... I'm having a moment of nostalgia. Dana and I have been friends for, I think, four years, maybe five. I don't, I don't know exactly, but we met up after SCMM, rode supermotos over by my area. The next weekend, rode it over by his area. He took us through the hills, and then from that moment on, we just started riding together, doing pretty much everything together. It's kind of crazy. I don't know, it's just, it's so crazy that through YouTube and through riding motorcycles, we all kind of met each other and then instantly we all just became the best of friends. I think the last time, oh crap. The last time I was here, going underneath these bridges, I was definitely on the 250 Supermoto. Are these bats? Is he really going across? No. Oh, he is. <laughs> that smells disgusting. to ride on smooth surfaces on the streets since I sold everything I sold my sport bike sold the mini all I kept was my dirt bike I forget how comfortable it is to ride when you have unlimited traction and there's just no bumps and you don't feel like you're gonna die every five minutes these were my roots <laughs> Wow, look at that. I 
Yeah, I this to took time. <laughs> like, look how smooth each surface yeah, is. Put a lot of work yeah, this is a lot of work. I had to pick my lines. I was just going for it. Oh! Justin! <laughs> he is the worst. <sighs> it's always Justin. Always. That's for. <laughs> That's big. The part that caves out right here, if you don't make it, you're falling back down. <laughs> what? Two times easier than the wall at the farm you go up. No way, really? I swear, I swear on my life. <laughs> oh my god. You gonna try it? Probably not. I'll give it a go. What? <laughs> Thank you guys. Thank you for coming to my channel. <laughs> oh, he was right. It was actually easier than the suicide wall we do at the farm. I got a little sweat on my eyebrow. What, what are we doing? We're going for an adventure. An adventure where? Up the side of a hill that may or may not lead anywhere. Is that enough explanation? Because that's kind of all I know to be honest. Okay. We can just go until we can't go. Okay. Okay, let's go. Alright, let's go. What is happening? Brian is such a goon sometimes. You know, Brian may not crash as much as I do. That's because he has longer legs than I do. But if you ever actually watch him, like, he's sort of a goon. Smoke the booty! I keep thinking we're gonna go through a bush of bees. connects to like Ortega Highway sort of thing like over there um, but if you're not from this area or California
why? I don't know. I should have just stood up instead of trying to put my bike in the rut and walk it. I just made it way harder on myself than I needed to. Oh, there's leaves in my mouth. I did the same exact thing you did. <laughs> I was like, I'm gonna go through the rut and put my feet down and it, it was so much harder to do it that way. Oh, that's not, that's pretty gnarly. Just through that left side, everything else is just blown out. Look at these views. This is awesome. No way. Dude! Oh my god! Gina's a killer! Gina's a killer! Oh my god! Gina made it up there? Oh my god! I can't believe you made it up that! Oh my god! Dude, that thing is Nars Barks! How did she make it up that? You impressed me like every time we ride. Oh, Brian is about to be so pissed going up this. <laughs> oh! You're dodging ruts all the way up and then when you get to here, you're about yeah. to keep throttling. Man, this hill is gnarly. I feel bad because <laughs> I was like, it's my birthday, I want to keep going. I didn't realize that Josh, when he's trying to manhandle his bike out of there, exerted all of his energy to the point where he was like about to pass out. So now he's super exhausted and we're pretty far in. So we're trying to decide, do we go back the way we just came or do we continue forward hoping that we're near the end and then we could just hit the streets and go back that way. So you see that mountain over there on the left? You see that road that's cut into it? That's the fire road. That's that's um, Santiago Peak. Or I mean, whatever the trail is called. So this should connect like o up through these ridges over there. And once it does, you're on a fire road. Oh gosh, where does this go? Oh. Oh, okay. Up here on the left. It's so overgrown, I can't see anything. Woo! This is a little scary. I freaking caught air. Oh gosh. Hold on, I gotta put my goggles on. It's like a million bugs hitting my face. if I went the right way.
probably not gonna make it, but. So don't fall off. If we're not getting your bike out. <laughs> so don't fall to the left. I see what you're talking about. You can't see this until you get up here. We got this guys. Once you get up this, it's clear. That's why I was trying to get past this, because like once I get up this. What? Oh really? It gets harder? I really wanted to just make it to Main Divide. Thanks for making I was up there and I was like, I'm not fucking turning around until I get up this. <laughs> I was like, I don't care if I'm up here for an hour, I'm getting up here. That's how I real I so I was like, man, I really want to get up there. I was being so selfish, everyone's dying on the trail. I'm like, oh, we're I going. Was I was with you. I was like, I want I was like we're so close, we have to. This little birthday adventure just turned into a pretty gnarly adventure. We ended up on this trail oh my gosh there's no traction anywhere we ended up on this trail tried to get to main divide didn't make it brian was upset because of how hot it was and josh was dying i'm kind of bummed i really wanted to make it up there but i mean it's starting to get late and uh Dana says the second hill is going to be a little more gnarly than the first one where everyone got stuck and that little rock section that I was just at. But I mean, it's really dry out here, so it's really slick and there's just no traction anywhere at all. So going up a super steep hill is way harder than it needs to be. I like how we asked, I asked actually, specifically me, asked for an easy day. I said I didn't want to struggle, didn't want to sweat too much. And, more importantly, I wanted to go back to the roots of when we first started making videos together. And then, of course, Dana finds a trail, and here we are. Ah! God, freedom. We made it. Woo! That was quite the adventure. I did ask for a birthday adventure and man, did I get one. <laughs> this is it. This is the end of the video. We actually made it back. We didn't make it all the way up to Main Divide, although Dana did. But, uh, yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed the birthday adventure ride. I got exactly what I asked for. Why is everybody flipping me off? Justin's flipping me off. Brian's flipping me off. I, I, I think everybody's upset that I made them go through that. <laughs> Uh-oh. No, 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 no. I do not want any part of this. Brian, oh my god. Brian, put that thing down. Put it on Gina. That's where I'm going. Don't! 
Brian, I'm dead serious. Don't do that. Brian, it's not funny. Stop. Do not put it on my bike. <laughs> this is how people get divorces. <laughs> yeah, that's a huge. Yeah, that's a big one. Oh my god. And I just had a moment of like fear, so much fear, like sheer panic. I genuinely thought that Brian was gonna try to throw it at me. Yeah, it's not a rattlesnake, but I don't, <laughs> I don't like snakes. Like it, they just scare me. But anyways. Back to what I was saying, I'm gonna end the video right here. I freaking love you guys, and hopefully I'll see you sooner than later. Until next time, peace. I be that young rapping dude, might just trap the jewel. Coming with the thunder, baby, might just clap the crew. I rolled out in the morning.